Justin Famoso. I, I really wanted to find out from you. Um, you specialize in radia radiation oncology. Right. What do you say to your patients when they've gotten the diagnosis of having cancer? Yeah, so there's a lot that happens from diagnosis to treatment. It, it can feel like a long winding road. So oftentimes I'm preaching patience, which is something that is hard to digest because you have cancer diagnosis, you want to run. Mm -hmm. You want to jump right in. Let's do treatment yesterday. Right. right. So oftentimes we have to just dial back and make sure we have all the information, understanding that one or two weeks is not going to be the end of the world. We're going to get it right the first time because we don't want to clean up on the back end. So we get our diagnosis first, know what we're dealing with, and then we have a better understanding of how to attack this cancer, how to treat it, and, you know, um, or even even discuss options. We need to know our information first. So. I love that. And I know that people, when they get that news, they think of the worst. Right. And, you know, you are a very positive person and you want to try to keep people's you know, temperament upbeat. Right. And just know that, hey, you're not alone. We're here to get, we're here to help you. And right. I think the thing that's most impressed me about Arizona Center for Cancer Care is that you have this team based approach. Yeah. And it's a whole team working in people's best interests to try to, you know, help them through their cancer diagnosis and through the treatment options for them. So, um, you know, you're not alone. It's a very alienating feeling when you have this cancer diagnosis. You feel alone, you feel lost. But at Arizona Center for Cancer Care, like I said, we have a whole team of doctors, nurses, and support staff to help you through it. And uh, yeah, we're here for you. Thank you for giving us this step. Yeah, Appreciate of course. It. You got it.